COVID-19 can have significant effects on our physical health, but it can also affect our psychological health. In my update today, I'd like to provide some tips on how you can remain well during the lockdown and reduce your fear levels. My first tip is to ensure that you remain up to date with advice around COVID-19, but please use a reliable source of information such as your local newspaper, the BBC website or the NHS website. Unfortunately, there's lots of misinformation that's circulating on social media and on WhatsApp groups that can be misleading and that can unnecessarily increase your fear levels. It's important that we don't allow COVID-19 to dominate our entire day, however. Please do limit the amount that you think, talk and read and listen to um, COVID-19 news. So it's important that you perhaps have a daily update just once so that you're able to also undertake other activities that you'd usually undertake during the day whilst respecting the social distancing measures. The third tip I'd like to give you is to stay connected with other people, talk about what's going on and share your own advice about what you've been doing during the lockdown and how you can manage it effectively. After all, when we exchange confidences, we derive social support and we may provide support to other people. Please make use of the resources that the Council has made available to you, such as the Community Hub, where you can gain advice and support during this difficult time. And I think the most significant tip that I'd like to give you is to focus on the things that you can actually do during this lockdown. And we all have the power to make a significant change, and that is by observing the social distancing measures. When we actually observe these measures, we're less likely to transmit the virus to other people and to become infected ourselves. And that can have a tremendous impact on managing this difficult situation. Thank you.